Hello, Summon Universe, and Xander, welcome to Pokemon Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon. We're now in the castle of Team Rainbow Rocket, Team RR, as they call themselves. Oh, well. Red, blue, yellow, we'll show you our rainbow strength. Let's see what you did there. Let's see what you did there. I don't like it. What do you got, like an Arbok? All that. Yeah. Okay, well, so Team Rainbow Rocket is quite genuinely one of my favorite um, storylines in a Pokemon game. I swear to two shots, man, I'm going to be pissed. Because it did exactly half my health on that last Super Fang. We're good. That's all I've got. Yeah, well, you know, sometimes it's just not good enough. So I just need to... Uh... Well, that was easy enough. Green, blue, blue, red, green? Now's my chance. Check my eyes awesome distracting pose. There's a bag over here. I'm surprisingly good at this sometimes. I had a decent I had a decent enough memory on that one. Blue, green, yellow, red. Green, blue, yellow, red. Oh shoot. I made a mistake just like we planned. Let's try again. Red, blue, yellow, Green, blue, red, blue, yellow, blue, green, yellow, red, green, red, blue, yellow, oh, you son of a, I have a notepad right in front of me, why am I not just like writing R, yellow, R, Y, B, R, son of a jerk. Son of a jerk, that's, yeah, that's what we're calling him. Can we not? Red. You dick blue green yellow red green blue yellow red I've already forgotten
<laughs> That's green. Yep. Blue. Another energy has your focus holding on. I got it this time. I had a pen ready this time. Okay, the nostalgia of fighting Team Rocket starting to wear off, by the way. That was Game Freak's way of saying, how dare you? How dare you get mad at our Gen 1 nostalgia? Gen 1 nostalgia, baby. It's all that matters. Oh, you've got two. Lovely. I genuinely don't know how I did this without cheating on, on Ultra Moon. I actually booted up my copy of Ultra Moon for the first time in years today. Uh, I was sitting ready to fight Reggie Ice, and I actually caught it today. And I caught a couple of uh, Ultra Beasts on it as well. I didn't read her dialogue because I knew it would mess me up. Suck it. Mm. There's a German Shepherd staring at me again. I'm not even surprised when he does stuff like that now. It's just kind of weird. He's a weird dog. Like, I always say I'm not gonna... Because, like, he's not coming with me when I move out of this house. Because I, I live with my dad still, for those that don't know. Um, mainly because I'm 20 and in college. Piss off. Um, I am going to move Mudsdale to the front for now. Because, like, Jalapeno has been having a rough time of it so far. Anyway, um... I'm not saying the dogs. The dogs aren't coming with me when I move. Obviously, you get past the glowing floor puzzles. Well, you won't get any further. Why can't I just battle both of you? Why you're gonna make me battle you one at a time? And it's gonna waste like five minutes. Like you're gonna have like a freaking coughing, like a haunter. Close enough. It's got levitate, doesn't it? Yep. Well, only one other option. Reduce it by 4 PP. That is a little ridiculous, don't you think? That's a significant amount to reduce it by, not even joking. I couldn't keep my promise to the boss. You have brains of Pokemon Bronze, you have far they'll get you. Your turn then, huh?
I'm really starting to regret having uh, someone other than Incineroar up front for once. Heavy slam, I suppose. Oh, man, if I power through this, you are screwed. Capital S. Again, it when I pow, when I inevitably power through this confusion, whether it be by breaking out of it or something, you're screwed. Yeah, you're screwed. You screwed yourself. You raised my attack two stages. I'm probably significantly heavier, and you're dead. You went the way of Amazing Spider-Man. I guess I'm not getting very far. Okay, I don't know who's beyond this door. I'm going to take an educated guess, though. Because that's just apparently the safest option, is to put my giant fire cat out front. Okay. Hey, pal. Been a while. What's it been? Two years? Let's see if I've still got it. Here I thought it was the obnoxious Franaba coming to pester me again, but all this ruckus was caused by a child. I am Team Magma's Maxi. I had finally realized my grand design, only to be swallowed by a great fissure that appeared beneath me. When I awoke, I was in this world. I'm enjoying this experience so far, though. The knowledge in this world is fascinating. I do intend to return to my own world eventually, but first... I've decided to bring my grand design to this world as well. I will use the magma controlling power of the continent Pokemon Groudon to shrink the oceans and create more glorious landmass. With more dry land to live on, the creatures of the land will no longer have to fight for territory. This is the ideal world for people in Pokemon with conflict. Without conflict, don't you agree? What the hell are those shorts you are wearing, child? Do you mean to interfere with my plans? You're just like that fool from Team Aqua. I cannot allow an inert child like you to get in our way. I, Maxi, will show you the consequences of meddling. Yep. Maxi of Team Magma. Or Team Rainbow Rocket now, I suppose. Mightyena was in a Master Ball. Notice that. Super effective, but by lowering our... He lowered our attack, so that is... Oh my goodness! Get out of there. Get out of there now. Oh, good job, Birdie. Oh, he's gonna hit Fire Fang this time, isn't he? Dick. If I can just hit it again, we're good. There it is. Oh, Birdie! Survived a crit as well! You defensive ass beetle. Oh no. Toby's faster, so Brick Break should finish the job. And Toby's got its uh, stats fixed now. There we go. One down. He's tough, isn't he? Camera upped. 
Let's do this. Hopefully, uh, hopefully we're faster. We'll find out what's faster, a camel or a horse. The horse is the faster. Whew. It is a good thing we got that thing knocked out. Crobat, um... Okay, um... Just be careful and get in there, Toby. I forgot Max, he was this tough. You know what? I, I didn't forget he was this tough. He wasn't this tough on my other... on my... on my playthrough on Ultraman because I had a freaking Mewtwo on my team. I had shiny Mewtwo. I looked back at my Ultra Moon team today. Like, they were all, like, in their level 70s and 80s. It was ridiculous. I must have put a lot of work into that game. And probably more trainer battles, let's be honest. Weezing's probably got Levitate, doesn't it? Got levitate now that I think about it. Let's try hitting with some psychic moves. Maxie's probably like, what the hell is that thing? Looking at it. Okay, I just had to double check. It's pretty sure psychic was the stronger. You know, Excellence, with that whole Psychic type, Dual type thing taken away, you really aren't the best, are ya? I kind of think the craziest thing here is that, um... I think the craziest thing about this battle is I've used all the Pokemon he's used so far on teams when playing through the fourth gen- or the third generation. Alright. Get him out of here. Ready for the big twist? Remember when he said he accomplished his grand scheme in his world? Groudon. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. You're not a fire type. I am. How's Groudon? Okay, I genuinely need to know how Groudon's faster than Incineroar. I would very much like to know how Groudon is faster than an Incineroar. Murphy, I'm gonna hope you're faster because we're gonna be genuinely effed if you die. Oh no! Even if Murphy had been at full health, Murphy was done for. F it. No! Come on! I was gonna say it worked on the Krasma. Was going to be my was going to be my hilarious joke there. It worked on the Krasma, so probably survive this, right? Yeah, we're good. Mimic you for the win. Let's do this. Play rough. Yeah, you just keep doing this solo game with her, Maxi. Mimic you will just keep eating. My sock baby will just keep eating them. 
Oh, the sunlight faded. Hilarious. You love to see it. Guess what? Ever seen one of these, Maxi? It's called a Z-Power. Watch this. Let's get him. Never ending nightmare. Groudon's never ending nightmare. It should just be water. Like a like a nerd like a uh, super soaker or something. Okay, we've literally just got to survive one more turn. So the safest choice here is going to be to just revive someone. Safest choice is just to use one revive and then we're good. Way to waste your turn, Maxi. I just killed your Groudon. Nice. I fell behind, but only by an inch. So you defeated the master of the land, the great Maxi. Still, I wonder what makes you so adept at handling Pokemon. There has to be some reason I was defeated. That's what you were trying to say, aren't you? Heh. <laughs> you don't think I didn't know that? This isn't my own world, after all. You truly wish to continue farther into Team Rocket's castle? There are two paintings that you will need to examine. One red and one blue. I have my noble cause to expand the landmass for the advancement of humanity. And Pokémon! This is the part, this is where we part. Yeah! Is that... No? Okay, that's... I know exactly what's going on. I know why they're barking, actually. I was gonna say, why are they barking, but now I'm remembering. My dad's moving his car to the par to the driveway closer to, um... The driveway cl I've been bamboozled. Come here, boy. Worth a shot, right? I was trying to get out of here. You just wanted that one F you, didn't you? Yeah. That's yeah, about my luck, isn't it? Let's uh let's go get healed by Lily, shall we? Hey Maxi, I'm back. What are you doing here, child? Nothing. Did I make him sound like Dr. Evil? That's kinda what I was going for. I was going for his anime voice, actually, but Dr. Evil is also kind of what it, went for, what it turned into. Okay. Alright, you lot. Just as we planned. Let's gang up on the intruder let them have it. Yeah! Do I seriously... Oh my god, do I seriously have to battle them one by one? If I do, I'm going to actually scream.
Am I about to fight the- Oh my god, can you not? Oh, can you not? Can you not? Stop it! And you shut up too. Okay, this might actually be the worst episode thus far in this series, and the series is like 40 episodes at this point. What, what, come on guys, so we did that together, didn't we? Sorry, sir. We just couldn't get the right timing. Well, because right now this is a real contingency plan. Same time now. Retreat! Okay, good. They, they just... I feel like there's probably some kind of... Yeah, this is a reference. This is exactly what this is. So you got through the grunt wall, did you? Not ex nothing unexpected. Let's do this just as planned. Brace yourselves. Huh? Well, this was supposed to be a pincer. Right, Ty. Well, why am I all alone? Blast, our plans failed. No matter, I'll stop you by myself. Uh, not that I mind Pokemon battles, just... This whole Team Rocket thing. Feels like a real cry for nostalgia so far. I've done it before, so I should know this, but like, it feels more like one than normal right now. Maybe this is with the hindsight of, uh, Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee and Generation 8. Get out of here. I didn't even remember what he said. Okay. Having to decide who to start with. I think you guys know who's coming next. I wouldn't let the episode drag on this long if it wasn't because someone big was next. Only after this, though. Here we go again. I'll stop you right here. No need for your supervisors to worry himself. Yeah. Yeah. Firo. When in doubt, Incineroar is kind of what I've gotten to at this point in the game. Incineroar has been my real fail safe through this game so far. I really hope that I take this guy out quickly. Let me show you. Oh my god. 
here we go again. Hello, Mark. Okay. Guess we'll just flare blitz it. Why not? We can heal up out of the battle. Oh, and you're burned. How about that? Ooh, that was a lot of recoil. Alright, flamethrower should end it though, right? Yeah, probably. I wanted to show the newbie how good I was, but, eh, well, you suck. Kind of what I'm gathering here. Okay. I know who's behind this door is the thing, and I don't want to risk it too badly. Let's go for it. <clears throat> huh? What's this? You defeated the team or our goons, did you now? Well, that's a shame. They weren't my real crew, but they were still mine for the moment. Name's Archie. I'm leader of Team Aqua. Just when I completed my great plan, I got swallowed up by a giant wave. And when I came around, I was in this world. Boss of Team RR was kind enough to get let me use this room as my own. I've been trying to figure out a way to get back to my own home. And I do what I I do want to go back eventually, but I find myself thinking. Maybe I should make this world more like my ideal while I'm here anyway. I've got the sea bass and Pokemon Kyogre. With its power to control the rains, I'll call it now a great deluge to wash away this world's land. All life is born from the sea. If we help the ocean expand, we're creating the cradle for future life to grow and thrive. Oh man, this is not an easy one to do. Best possible future of, po of people in Pokemon, don't you think? Why are you wearing, why are you wearing bike shorts? Oh, so you want to get in my way, just like that buffoon from Team Magma. Well then, you little scamp. It's the rope's end for you and your Pokemon. I need a drink of water after that one. See, this is my kind of nostalgia. The Gen 3, Gen 3 and 4 nostalgia is where you get me. I was in, I was in school. I was in elementary school when Gen 3 came out. Or when Emerald came out, at least. I was in, uh... And I was in like second or third grade, maybe, I don't know, when uh when Gen 4 came. Fourth grade, I think. 2008 is what I remember. See, I knew they were both gonna start I knew he was gonna start with Mighty Anna when Archie did or when Maxie did. There we go. Glad we got back in time to see me do superpower and probably one shot Mighty Anna, hopefully. Really? Come on now. I intimidate probably didn't help, honestly. Torpedo. Okay, yep, now nah, we're switching. Hey, Birdie, you know what? You're quad resistant, right? Dark and. Yeah, dark and water type. You're quad resistant to, to it. And now you're not so much because of liquidation, right? I've talked about my issues with the Pokemon move liquidation in the past. 
It's in this Let's Play, you'll find it eventually. Now, Sharpedo is not a Pokemon I can say I used when playing through uh, Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire. Muck I can say I used. I miss my old Muck. I think I called him Glooper. Or Glooper or something. Because he's a pile of gloop. I had a friend who was always convincing me that it was a horrible Pokemon to have on my team because his Alakazam could one-shot it with Psychic, and it's like, well, yeah, but it's because that's a severe type advantage. When did Toby hit that level? It's nice. I forgot to mention that. Archie is going down a lot easier than Maxie did. All that's left. You know what it's time for. How about some Bloom Doom, Kyogre? Oh, right, you've got that, yep. Should have thought that one through. Yeah, yeah, should have, uh... Should have thought that one through, shouldn't I? Fine, we can just do this one more time, we're good. Hydro Pump shouldn't one shot, right? Mm, it's a legendary Pokemon, of course it will. Well, you know what it's time for. Let's just do it again. When in doubt, toxic it out. Or just don't. Or you just don't. You just miss again. You missed twice, apparently. How does Toxic miss twice? Okay. I feel, I feel like Incineroar's faster. It's not. And this move that's only, that's got a horrible chance of missing, hits four times in a row. For, for those keeping score. Okay. I feel like Toby's probably faster. There we go. This isn't going to do much, but it might be able to take it out, given it's on, like, probably a third of its health left. Here we go. Good job, everybody. Look, I figured. Well, would you look at that? I control the ocean and all its power, and yet here I am, beaten by a little kike. I said tyke, by the way. I heard what that sounded like. I said tyke. All right, all right. You've made your point. It's just very hard to say tyke in that voice. I swear. So if anyone heard something else, I strongly apologize. All right, all right. You've made your point. I can see you're not one to be trifled with. If you want to get further into the Team Rocket's castle, 
You better, you checked out the pictures hanging on the wall. The red one and the blue one, too. Makes me wonder, there was a trainer like you back in my old world. Would I have ever been able to pull off my great dream? I don't know, but your voice killed me. Guys, I'm gonna please tell me you just knock him silly for me. <laughs> yep. Hey, you found the prez yet? You alright there? Ah, oh, come on, you grunts. Tell me where the prez is or else. We're not gonna tell you anything. Even if we did, you wouldn't be able to reach her anyway. I can't breathe through cover my face like that. He's right, if you want to get past the mirror, you'll need to get to the second floor. But the cord can't activate the switch, you'll never be able to do it. <laughs> I still can't breathe. I might not be one to talk, but these dudes are stupid. Oh, you're still wandering around here. You better hurry, little tyke, or what you're looking for will be gone forever. What are you two weirdos? And what do you mean gone forever? Well, that's not the big buffoon himself, Archie. Hey, careful you call it names, Maxie. I seem to recall you cowering the feet in front of me. Huh. Such nonsense. No matter what world we're in, I would never lose to the likes of you. Oh, you want to sell it? Prove it now! Come on, let's sell this right here, right now! As you wish. Let the Victor take a little and do with it as he pleases. Agreed! Hey. Hey, hey, what are you talking about? This isn't your turf. Huh? What's this? Well, damn. Hey, what's going on here? Yo, I got these goons. You head upstairs. I'll do that in a second. I'll actually do that next episode. So, uh, thanks for watching this episode, everybody. Uh, unintentionally sounded like said something very racist. Or, aside... Again, apologies if that's what it sounded like. I really hope it didn't. I've been Xander, and that was Pokemon. See you tomorrow.